So every day you hear CNG, LNG, OPG, and you're like, what's the difference between these gases? This is what we're going to talk about today. Now, the first one, which you hear more often these days, because the government has been pushing for its use, and that is CNG. CNG means compressed natural gas. Now, this is natural gas that is gotten from the ground. It is then processed, and then it is compressed so that it can fit, you know, the cylinders they use in our buses, trucks, and even cars nowadays. If you don't compress the natural gas, then you would need enormous tanks for you to be able to use it in your cars, which is not sustainable. Now, the next one is liquefied natural gas. This is the same natural gas. The formula is CH4. It's also called methane. It is the same natural gas, but is converted to liquid, thereby called liquefied natural gas. And it is turned to liquid by cooling it down to minus 161 degrees Celsius. Yes, and this is done to make it easier for transportation. When you convert natural gas to liquid, it actually saves more space. In fact, it, the volume goes down like 200 to 250 times. This would enable them to put them in cryogenic tankers and ship them around the world. And when they get to their destination, they're regasified. They have to turn it back to gas so that they can use it to power industries for heating and so on. The last one is LPG, which stands for liquefied petroleum gas. This is not like the other two. It is not natural gas. It is not methane. It is propane and butane. These are the main components of LPG. And this is gotten through the processing of crude oil. Interesting enough, this is the gas that we use in cooking here in Nigeria. Hope you learned something today. If you like more breakdowns like this, Make sure you indicate in the comments. And if you have any questions about this, comment too. Thank you very much for watching.